Oh yes, yes, y'all. Y'all know what time it is. Welcome back to Buffed Up TV. So listen, we're gonna talk about what Colorado's blowout of Arizona revealed. So the Colorado Buffaloes have officially surpassed last season win total in year two under Coach Prime. Listen, if they continue to play like they did on Saturday. Colorado football fans will be in for a special season. See, you played a near perfect game. Despite some hiccups here and there. But they just totally washed Arizona 34 to 7 to improve to 5 and 2 overall and 4 and 1 in the Big 12. So from the opening snap. Arizona had no answer for Colorado's offense as the Buffs scored on their first three possessions on defense. CU held Arizona to its lowest point total of the season while keeping star wide receiver T. McMillan quiet. So here are some takeaways from this impressive road victory that I had. Number one. Colorado held Noah Fafita to his lowest passing game of his career, 138 yards. And T. McMillan was held to five receptions for 38 yards. And Travis Hunter wasn't even in there for the majority of the game. Number two, we are undefeated when we have over 12 carries. We had 39 carries for 148 yards rushing in this game. That's key. So number three, Colorado's pass rush was on another level, sacking Arizona's quarterback seven times because of the feeder's uh, ability to escape the rush. He prevented that sack total from being in the double digits. Keaton Wade showed up and showed out. He took advantage of his first snaps of the season coming off of the injury. He and fellow defensive lineman Samuel Okanlola led the way with two sacks apiece. Moving on, RJ Johnson may have made one of the biggest plays of the game by recovering that opening onside kick. That was huge. That was huge. I thought it was quite disrespectful, but either way, moving on, starting fast. CU scored on its first three possessions and seemed well on its way to making it four straight before the botched snap from Hank Zelinkis early that uh, caused the fumble. Either way. Uh, Next up, since dropping... The first road game against Nebraska, the Buffs have dominated teams away from Boulder. In three road games against Colorado State, UCF, and Arizona, Colorado has outscored its opponents 110-37. to Listen, guys. Colorado showed up and showed out, man. And I'm telling you, this defense looked like I, I don't even I, I I don't even have any words for it, man. These guys were flying around. These guys were making plays. That pass rush was lethal. And I'm telling you, if we play anything like this going forward, it's going to be a problem for the for the Big Twelve. But we got a big game coming up next week in Cincinnati, man. We got to uh, we got to win at home. We got to win at home, and uh, that'll solidify our position uh, in a bowl game. But that's all I really got, guys. Great game from Colorado. Complete game from Colorado. Special team showed up and showed out. But uh, until the next one, peace and blessings to all, and I'm out.
I want to see you practice. Anybody could put together a highlight tape of my highlights. Let me see your whole game and your lowlights. I want to see you practice because normally how you practice, that's who you are. That's who you are. The person you are at home, when nobody's looking, that's who you are. The person that said, oh, oh they said that, that darn, they ain't gonna never make that darn leaderboard. They ain't right, they cheat, and they doing that, and they play favoritism. That's who you are. Ain't nobody want that. Ain't nobody want no complainer. I want somebody smart, tough, fast, disciplined, with character.